Hi there, welcome to Kevy Shaves. It's nice to see you and it's nice to be back here shaving. I hope your week has gotten off to a good start and uh, I hope you had some great shaves over the weekend and I hope they continue into this week. Okay, first things first for the shave, I'm gonna put on some uh, Nuage Men shaving oil, pre-shave. Um, just a few squirts of that. One, two, three, four, five. I'll just rub this in. I'm going to use things today I haven't used in a while that have been uh, sent recently. But uh, I just thought I haven't used this uh, pre shave oil in a while, so I'll give that a go. Yeah, there's a nice scent on this. It's a uh, lavender with a little bit of uh, menthol. Nice. Okay, we'll just uh, let that soak into the skin. Just uh, let me get my phone and uh, put it on silent. I don't want any disru in in disruption, disruption or interruptions uh, in the shave. So, okay, that's the uh, pre-shave one. Okay, let me show you what I'm uh, using today. I haven't used this in a while, so uh, I'll show you. This is the Fit Jar Islands, Fit Jar Islands Slatteroy. Uh, they sent me a few soaps, these little sample pots. Uh, this one is a uh, warm spices with a hint of citrus. Very nice. Um, yeah, there it is there. There's the cream. It's a cream. So uh, I'm going to be bowl lathering, and I haven't used this in a long time. It's the Kevy Shaves Bowl. Remember this, people? <laughs> um, yeah, I haven't used that in a while, so I'm going to put the cream in there. Uh, the brush I'm going to be using is West Coast Shavings 26mm uh, synthetic. There's the coin in the bottom there. That's going to focus. There we go. Yeah, red and white. These come in uh, three different colours. I'll put links to everything on the, in the description and you can go and check them out. Nice knot on this. Um, not much back going to it, but very, very soft. Um, yeah, it's a good brush, nice handle. Uh, so that's that. The razor. Okay, I uh, mentioned in the last shave that uh, Felix from uh, Vienna in Austria sent me some razors. Uh, and this is one of them he sent me that I'm going to use today. It's a Segus, it's a Segus Zeppelin, uh, and it's a stainless steel razor. Uh, this was the first one to come out. I think they've um, kind of tweaked it a little bit since then, but the first one came out in this uh, tin. Uh, Segus, you can see there. Um, I'll just open it up uh, and show you the razor. It's a three piece razor. I'll just uh, put it together just to let you guys see. It's a 316L stainless steel. It's made in Spain. Here it is here. Yeah. Um, and you can notice the curve there. Yeah, there's the uh, underside. Yeah, it's a great looking razor. Um, good weight to it being stainless steel. Um, the blade gaps on this, as you can see, one side is scalloped. Uh, and the other side is just a straight bar, just plain. Uh, this plain is 0 0.3 of a millimeter. This is 0 0.5 of a millimeter. So you have the option on both sides. Um, the blade I'm going to be putting in that is a Trig, brand new Trig. These are made by Treat uh, in Pakistan. So I'll be putting that in that. So what I'll do just now is I'll, I'll, I'll show you the razor. I'll give you some close-ups of the razor. Uh, I'll get the cream in the bowl, I'll mix the cream up, I'll put the blade in the razor and we'll come back and we'll get the shave going. I'll start lathering up. But um, I'll let you have a look at the razor now and I'll explain how these curves and stuff work. Uh, so you guys can take a look at that. I'll get things prepped here and I'll see you shortly. Okay, so here is the Segus Zeppelin uh, all stainless steel razor made in Madrid in Spain. Yeah, as you can see, nice knurling on the handle. And uh, also underneath here, 
it says Zeppelin España 2019 uh, Sega 316L yeah it's very nicely made okay I'll just um, lift it up and show you the, the head now this is the scalloped side um, which you can see let me just get that to stand there yeah as you can see the little scallops along here uh, and you can see the curve on the head and the uh, the blade now I'm not exactly sure what that's supposed to do uh, this side this the scallop side is uh, 0 0.5 of millimeter and the other side which is the just the straight bar uh, as you can see no scalloped on that side uh, it's the same it has the same curve that's 0 0.3 of a millimeter uh, they also do these uh, the head in 0 0.5 and 0 0.7 and a 0 0.7 and a 0 0.9 um, yeah so you can see it there I'll just show you the top cap and um, you can see where the blade curves well the blade doesn't curve it's actually the it's actually the head that curves see the top cap has actually um, I'll just try and get that in shot yeah you can probably see it there look there's more blade exposure in the the middle of the blade than there is at the ends obviously designed that way but um, we'll see how it shaves well I've used this before but um, it's very mild but obviously with the, the bigger blade gaps that you can get now it will uh, probably give you a, a more efficient shave yeah you could maybe see that there look just with the, the, the way the, the top cap kind of curves in but very nice very nicely made okay let's go back now to the shave okay and we're back uh, and as you can see this uh, really easy to mix this cream up it's a beautiful scent on this it's a it's a spicy kind of scent um, yeah very nice let me show you the razor I've put the blade in there um, hopefully you've seen some nice close-ups I'll uh, no overhang whatsoever on this razor very good you can see really see the curve on that but uh, I have used this and it is very mild uh, 0 0.3 on this side 0 0.5 of a millimeter on this side so quite a mild razor um, but it's very smooth <laughs> okay let's get this uh, lather on the face just uh, going to dip the tips of the brush there I don't want to make it too wet in the bowl so I can uh, add water once it's on the face but these uh, fit jar creams, fit jar islands are very easy to uh, create a lather whether it's in the bowl or just putting a little bit in the brush look at that cream, look at that that's excellent Yeah, as I was saying, um, Segus now, they, I think they've modified the head a little bit um, and they do a, a wider blade gap. Um, this was the initial one was 0 0.3 and 0 0.5 um, and I think some people thought it was too mild. It is very mild but it's still comfortable. I'm just going to dip the tips a little bit again. It's a great lather. Um, so they've now released a 0 0.5 and a 0 0.7 and also a 0 0.7 and a 0 0.9 and as I say they're uh, handmade in Madrid in Spain there we go very nice ok let me get rid of that I'll get some heat into this trig blade ok I'll use the uh, the non-scalloped side first and I'll just kind of change it up 
so this is the 0 0.3 side. Yeah, very mild. So I'm flipping it over to the 0 0.5. Yeah, and you can feel the difference straight away. Uh, I'm not sure what the curve is supposed to do. I think it's a. Uh, I think it's supposed to make it kind of like a slant razor. So I'm turning it over to the. <laughs> this is the milder side, the 0 0.3. Yeah, you can definitely feel a difference. Um, even in 0 0.2 of a millimeter. <laughs> well, I tell you what, it's taking the stubble off, which is uh, the main thing. Right, I can see that's the scallop side, so I'm using the 0 0.3 side. Yeah, some people <laughs> will probably say. Well, wow, that's uh, too much hassle. I just want to shave. I don't want to worry about what side of the razor I'm using. It's beautiful balance and a uh, nice weight, nice handle. Very mild, but um, sometimes that's good if you just want a mild shave. Yeah, actually, <laughs> right. I'm just going to use the uh, the scallop side. It's uh, very easy to find the angle on it. Pardon me. <laughs> okay. First pass done. Let's have a little feel. Feels nice. It's uh, really reduced that. Three days growth, no problem. Okay, let me rinse and come back for pass number two. Yeah, nice uh, slickness from that cream. Yeah, it's a nice scent. I always think of these creams as being, um, you know, when you stay, not that I've stayed at many, but when you stay in a, like a fancy hotel and uh, they have all these nice shower gels and soaps in the bathroom. I always imagine that um, Fitchar Islands. <laughs> that's the uh, that's the kind of if they put, if they provided shaving cream in these bathrooms, they would be uh, Fitchar Islands. They're beautifully packaged, really nice looking, and uh, yeah, they just perform very very well. As you can see in this uh, West Coast shaving brush. Yeah, there's, there's not really much backbone to the knot, but it's so soft. It's just a pleasure to paint the lather on like this. Yeah, and I was... Uh, I was talking with Felix, um, who sent me this razor. Um, I was talking to him on Instagram, and he wanted to get a a bowl, like the uh, like the Kevy Shaves bowl. So I, I emailed him the uh, the address of the the pottery, and uh, he contacted them. So he's going to get a 
he's going to get a ball made. So he's happy. <laughs> okay, second pass. Let's go with the. Uh, let's go with the zero point three. Yeah, and, um, yeah. You can hear the feedback on that. I was talking with uh, Ernie Rocca. Some of you might know Ernie from Facebook or Instagram. And uh, yeah, we were just saying uh, how much good stuff is out there just now. And I said, I always, I just, the thing I like about shaving this way is there's so much choice and I love using different things, trying out different razors and stuff and uh, I'm very lucky that I get sent some good stuff. Uh, but I always want to share it on this channel with you guys just to, just to let you see how it performs. Right, see, I'm not even looking, and I think I know that that's the uh, 0 0.3 side. Yep, I'm correct. I'm correct. That's in between right and correct. I'm correct. Yeah, you're not right, Kevy. <laughs> not right in the head. What? <laughs> I've got a bit lost here. I'm supposed to be going across the growth. Yeah, see that's the uh, that's the 0 0.5 side. I can feel the difference right away. I was surprised when uh, I got this razor because um, Felix sent it over, and I think about two days before, I'd added my name to a, a pass around on uh, one of the forums. For the exact same razor, but the one with the, the 0 0.5 and 0 0.7. The, yeah, the ones that they make now on this uh, underside, it has it has the numbers here, like 0 0.5, 0 0.7, or whatever side. But it doesn't have it. This is the kind of first ones that they brought out. So, but still. Again, nice reduction. Feels great. Let me rinse a combat for pass number three. Very enjoyable, very mild, but good. Nicely rinsed. Back for the third pass. Still um, plenty of cream in this brush. Yeah, the scent on this is... Uh, it's, uh, it is spicy, it's kind of peppery, there's a little bit of citrus going on in there too. Yeah, very nice, very, uh, it even smells very high end. It smells really good. feather in this but I thought no let's uh, let's just go with a, a kind of standard blade um, just to see how it does
Yeah, you can really feel. <laughs> well, I can really feel the difference when I um, when I flip it over from uh, 0 0.5 to 0 0.3. I've got no straight away. You could even probably tell by the uh, the audio feedback. This is the 0 0.5 side. Oh, it's very smooth, very smooth. Look at that. Yeah, um, I would imagine I'm looking forward to trying out the, uh, the 0 0.5, 0 0.7 and the, the pass around. I'm not sure when I'll get that razor, it might be a, a few weeks yet. My name's um, quite far down the list, so. Very comfortable because it is so mild. But, um, I don't feel like I'm having to go over lots of spots. as well. It's a good thing that there's uh, no overhang on this razor, which is great. Okay, let me have a little rinse. Smooth, smooth, pick up, pick up. Yeah, so I'm going to use the, uh, the scalloped side for this, for the pickups. Because that's uh, three times I've went over this area and uh, I still haven't got the hair, so let's go with a slightly more efficient side. You can hear that. But because it isn't a, a massive blade gap, um, it feels very mild and uh, comfortable. I bet the other plates are excellent. You know, the slightly more efficient ones. Tiny bit there. 
a little spot there. Okay, feels good. Quick rinse. Yeah, feels nice. Okay, let me uh, scoop out what's left from this brush. Woo, look at that. Very nice. Okay, you know the drill. Face wash, clean my gear, rinse with uh, cold water. I'll see you if the post shave. Nice shave, nice, nice shave. Nice and close, what more could you ask for? Okay, uh, aftershave, I haven't used this in a long time. Alt Innsbruck, uh, this is great stuff. A nice uh, smoky kind of scent. Very nice though, leaves the skin feeling great. Is there any tingle there? A little bit. Just here. And there is some menthol in this. Oh, that's beautiful. That's really nice. I've forgotten how good that smells. Oh. Oh, yeah. Excellent. And to finish it off, uh, I've got some of the Fitjar Islands Slateroy Aftershave Moisturiser. Uh, yeah, these have just recently came out, but again, beautiful packaging. Look at that. The scent of fearless spirit and exotic adventure. <laughs> yeah, very nice. Great. Uh, paraben free. I'll give you a look. You can you can read it here. I think the ingredients actually are on the uh, the box. Yeah, anyway, one, two, three, four pumps. And there it is there. Yeah, my eyes are going with that um, menthol. Wow, look at that. <laughs> yeah, a little goes a long way. This has some menthol in it as well, I can smell. But, um, yeah, that's nice. With a, uh, it smells similar to the soap, uh, to the cream, sorry. But mixing in well with that Alt Innsbruck. And that, there you can see, look, it's uh, rubbed in very easily, absorbed into the skin. Nice shave. <sighs> Kevy's happy. Kevy's happy. Very happy. Okay, let me uh, show you what we've used again. Uh, we started off the shave with the Nuage Men shaving oil. Uh, things I haven't used in a while. The brush was the West Coast Shaving uh, 26 millimeter two color synthetic knot. Very nice. I'll put links to everything and you can Go and check them out. Great brush. Bow lathered in the Kevy Shaves bowl. Um, uh, the cream was Fitjar Islands Slateroy. Am I saying that properly? Any Norwegian or Slateroy? Slateroy. Sorry if I've butchered that there. <laughs> uh, that was the cream we used in the bowl. The razor, fantastic. Segus Zeppelin. Um, yeah, little curves on this. No overhang. Very nice. All stainless steel. Um, I can't wait to try the, the other heads with a, the slightly wider blade gaps. Yeah, really smooth. Very mild. If mild razors are your thing, um, if you're a daily shaver, this would be great. Um, Possibly with a maybe with a wider gap, but as you can see, it was a mild shave, but very comfortable, very enjoyable. 
no problems. Inside that was a Trig uh, blade. First use on that, these are made by Treat. Good blade, done the job. Um, we then had a face wash, rinsed off with cold water. Um, post shave was, uh, after shave was Alt Innsbruck. Absolutely fantastic stuff. If you've never smelt this, try and get a sample or uh, just try it. <laughs> I can't recommend it highly enough. It's so good. Uh, and then we finished off with the Fit Jar Islands Slatteroy Aftershave Moisturiser. And there we have it. Whew. Very soft. Yeah, I, I've no complaints about that shave. Uh, the razor wasn't aggressive, it was very mild, but it done the job. It was uh, comfortable, nice to use. Yeah, I just, uh, there's, there's nothing to. Would I have liked it to be more aggressive? Well, no, because that's what I used. So you can get more aggressive um, heads for it. There is a more aggressive head, but uh, with a wider blade gap. But I should use that. I'll, I'll, uh, I'm looking forward to trying that in the. There's a pass around, as I say. So I will um, try that out and show you guys it on camera. Uh, so that's all for today's shave. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed it. Something a little bit different. Um, yeah, it's probably not for everyone having to flip sides and stuff, but there you go, it was, uh, it was nice to, to show off and let you guys uh, take a look and uh, yeah, I'll uh, put links to everything as I say and you can check it out. Okay, uh, that's all from me for today. <laughs> no. <laughs> I'm joking. <laughs> that's all from me for today. Nice shave. Okay, I'll uh, see you in the next video and uh, have yourself some fantastic shaves. Enjoy life and live it to the full. And until then, take care. See ya.